Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I'm going to show you step by step process how you can easily use fresh color made by Freshworks. The first thing you want to do is go to top right and click sign up. Then you just simply add an email address. So then click sign up. Let's just wait until it's going to load. And then I'm going to show you what you can achieve. And here we go. So when you're going to enter uh, your fresh color on a first as my performance, you would see incoming calls as a total calls, answered calls, missed calls, voicemails, total calls, answered calls and missed calls by outgoing and incoming. And then under it, you would see your recent calls. Then on the live dashboard, you would see the service level metrics average wait time, average handle time, and really just deeper analytics of understanding uh, how it works. Then on the right side and bottom, you would see in QoA, in conversation and all agents here. When you would go further, you would see contacts here where you can simply click here and add a new contact and you can import contact list or add a new contact. You would add a contact name on the right side, Marcus email address and just phone number and company name click save and voila here you have a contact name you can simply con click on it and see every single contact what you can do also is to simply add a company this is the same style go on the bottom uh, on the top right add a new company company name company email company phone address, website and contacts. So this is how we can add a contact and this is how we can add companies. When you would go further, you can click call metrics and you would see uh, the metrics here. You can use fresh color to set up your very own cloud telephone and ensure you effectively engage with every customer. Hi. So this is uh, where you would find your call metrics. Pretty straightforward and pretty easy. On the bottom right also, you would see the test connection and you can have like ready to make a call. Your network and audio settings will be tested to ensure you experience the best call quality. So when you go to bottom right, start test. And you need to test everything. So as you can see, everything works flawlessly and it's going to test out. <coughs> So what you need to do is just buy phone credits and this is how you can call. Oh, you need to like allow it in your browser. So again, I will come here, test connection. And now it should go. So this is how you can do it. And you need to first test your connection and then you will be able to do it. And you will be able to call. You need to also buy the full credits. Record a message in three, two, one. Oh, this is a voice message that I'm recording. Well, this is a voice message that I'm recording. And as you can see. Record a message in three, two, one. This is a voice message that I'm recording. You said. This is a voice message that I'm recording. So as you can as you can see guys, you need to test things out if it works for you. And block. And this is pretty much it. Right? So you need to allow a camera. I'm not going to do it right now, but this is how we do it. Then you will have reports here. Reports are a great way how we can see the service level metrics, abundant call metrics agent activity report, what they were doing, how they were acting. Then you're going to have like a voicemail drop here. If you call, you get made calls to voicemail. You can leave a pre-recorded message and move on to next call. This is a really great way if you're, let's say you're on lunch and you just click here, new voicemail drop and uh, you can record your own message or you can create your own like voicemail drop one. Hey, this is Marek from 
to talking to you about something and add a voicemail, right? Hi, this is Merrick from Sunway. I was looking forward to talking to you about something. My number is number. Please call me back. And this is how you can do it. What you can do also add your own new voicemail drop. So what does it mean that let's say uh, you want to call someone? Uh, you can just leave pre-recorded message and just move on. Let's say that they're not going to be um, available. This is the great way what you can achieve with a voicemail drop. Then you have a power dialer. Start by creating a desired power dialer list by adding contacts. You just simply import contacts and you can use power dialer. And then you have like settings here as numbers. You can buy a new number here. Then you're going to see the business hours. Also call workflows. You can create like Quayway and plenty of workflows here. And then you have like call tags, messages, and agents. On the top right, you would see notifications here. Like what's new. And then you can edit the profile settings here as your name, email address, uh, time zone, language, and ring on speakers and headphones, not only on speakers. This is something you can set it up. So, yep, you can also have other chat with us. And just like ask questions, etc. That's pretty straightforward too. But the most important thing is bottom right, just the test connection here. And then start calling by just pressing the button. You need to buy a phone calls. And that's pretty much it. So thank you very much guys for watching. If you're gonna have any questions, ask me down in the comments. I will be happy to help you and provide some guidance and support. You know how it is, you know how it goes. And yeah, have a great day and goodbye. See ya.